flesh. All right, what's going on, everybody? Let's do this. Serator is a set with new runes. And this is a really short game, but still, I think it's worth showing pretty much any game against a set. Because it's one of those champions who can counter Serot really easily. And I'm gonna show you guys how you can play against Sid without buying Shiona Hourglass. Shiona's Hourglass, or whatever it is. My pronouncement is so bad, it's, it's ridiculous. But yeah, I was running with the same build. I even have that sudden impact still. Because it was one of those games I still thought. It's actually working on a Zerat, but yeah, as you guys pointed out, it's not. I just, as soon as the new runes came out, I just like did a bunch of games and three games in a row were like really good games. And uh, I'm just gonna show you the, show the gameplays and uh, I play with the same runes. What can I say? I think this uh, set was running with, what's it called, the new Thunderlord, Electrocute, yeah, yeah. So yeah, he was running with Electrocute, it's like the Thunderlord used to be. And as I said, I think everybody actually got weaker. They can't buy those flat magic generation rules anymore. So you can see everybody's 35. I mean, say it is at 35 magic resist. And I just got stronger. It's just uh, from the arcane comet. As you can see, it said it's almost dead. Good times. And a good old flash cube. I mean, as soon as he used the shadow, I mean, he could have jumped back, I guess, to the shadow. I'm not sure here. Doesn't matter, I got the kill. I guess it's worth it. But not always. For the first kill I think it's worth it. For the gold at least. Gets me gets me going, you know. You can buy more more items. More damage. That stun would have been nice. He just used the shadow. I gotta, I gotta stun him to a QW and finish with the ultimate because he can't escape with the shadow. I guess he still has flash, but yeah, I don't know. Some set players are really good. It's again depends on the player. No, it's actually oh here we go ultimate stun ah, and ultimate he even used ignite and it's not just damage I think it's like 
Yeah, we got damage wise, we got good boss, but as I said, everybody got weaker. They can't get that flat magic, magic resist up from the runes. There's a few, few runes that can give you magic resist, but it's it's not even close what it used to be. It's like half of that, even less. And everybody lost lost magic resist, and we gained damage. So that's that's a, that's the big difference. It's not just damage. Ultimate up. Oh, Almost double kill. I will show you true power. As soon as the new runes came out, first games were really good. I was like, what the hell? But then again, lately I've been struggling. Not so much for the mid lane. This was probably the weakest set ultimate ever. I got dodge everything. This guy st stole my kill. Goddamn stealers. Say something, forgot. That's what happens. When somebody steals your kill, you forget everything. Oh yeah. Lately I'm just struggling, but not so much from the mid later. I'm still fine. Feel strong against any mid laner, but. Yeah, playing in day times, so I had like a couple of rage quitters, and four versus five is just not gonna, it's not gonna work. Not in diamond. But yeah, you guys ask me for Welcos video. I'm gonna try to work on that Soraka video. So I have to play some Soraka Welcos. And obviously some Serrat videos. Everybody's pushing. Towers without even. I don't even, I'm not even sure if they have wars. Doesn't look like it. I'm just running. Bottom top, just taking the kills. It's too easy. Doesn't feel. Doesn't feel like diamonds, to be honest. But actually, every game I got to show you guys, it's uh, it's been ranked. Red diamond. Sometimes it feels like this is this is not not diamond. It's bronze at least. I don't really have damage, I have two levels ahead of him, so he's gonna, yeah. Damn, come on, really? That arcane golem should have finished him off. Maybe if I had that uh, rune, that's good. If the enemy is 40% health. You do 10% more damage. 
An enemy has been slain. Maybe with touch run. It's uh, under precision. What the hell is it even called? Your team has destroyed a turret. It's cryptic race. Cryptic race? Is this real? It deals 10% more damage to champions who have less than 40% health. And additionally, takedowns on champions currently attack the bonus. 15 ability power for 10 seconds. And Anivia support is apparently stronger than Set. I'm still rushing magic generation boots, land of torment. I could have gone actually. Mage eyes, because I have 10 stacks. We're gonna go choice also. I mean, you can clearly see, I think those games were. Daytime. So when you play daytime, it's younger, younger players, definitely more younger players. When you play evening or nighttime, it's more mature players, older. Almost two kills. And yeah, that's why it was a short game because the enemy just gave up. Let's say. Yeah, thank you for watching, more videos coming soon, and uh, see you next time.